Okay, this is our land. This is the top of the road as you come up. This is what you see when you come up. There's our power pole. There's John's car and John's house. Now if you go down this road, it's pretty barren up here right now because obviously it's winter. There's a lot of junk around here that we still have to, that was all here when we got here, it's all gonna get torn down and that area will be a high tunnel and a garden. This is all stuff that we've collected to build with. That's gotta get cleaned up too. That's our water catch. And this is our shop area. All built out of stuff we found. Again, more stuff that we've collected, windows for the houses. That big blue tarp area, that's a common area behind the trailer. Then that one building to the left is storage area. And as you come up in the front, this is where all of our propane and electrical meets up in here. Go around the side here. This is another little A-frame tarp storage area. This kind of dark, but this is our area we hang out when it's warmer with a campfire in the middle. If you turn around and go back out, there's the privy. The back side of that will be a solar shower for summer. This is the privy itself. There's our steps going up to it. That area over there is where John's tent is, but that'll be coming down and be wood storage. Now he's in his house. Now if you drive go up further up the road, you can see that's where our house is. A lot of cleanup to still do, but we're getting there. That's the tent and area that we were in for seven months. But if you go across the road, that's where our house is now. If you look up all up there, all of our property goes all the way up to the top of the ridge. And if you see, there's another road that goes up here. Here's a burn pile that didn't burn all the way, but it's getting there. This road goes up to the top and we own all the way up to the top of that too on the right side and sometime after the first year we will be purchasing the left side so we'll have a total of 17 acres so that's pretty much the property right now walking back down to our path and up to the house this back end of the house that's the other part that's where our loft will be so the house will be almost twice as big as it is right now. The plastic that you see on the bottom is just to keep the wind from getting under there until we can build something more permanent.